to Talk Home to Camel Show. I'm your host, Camel, and I have great guests. Um, actually, they was out in the pool, by the pool, and I went and brought them in to me. Tell them your name. Hi, Christina. I'm Dawn. How y'all doing? Good. We are I know, feeling good. Good, good. Fabulous. I know you outside, enjoying the pool, and I brought you in. Oh, yeah. Are y'all mad at me for that? Mm. Uh, a little. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sun's out right now. We're missing it. And I see y'all enjoying yourselves. Well, of course. Of course. You know, so tell me, um, what do you really do for a living? Like, what do you do for a living? Well, I'm an office administrator, mm -hmm. accountant. Very good. Yep. Okay, and you? I clean houses. Very I good. am a detail cleaning lady. Yes. Okay. We don't call ourselves maids because it's not what we do. We do <laughs> detail cleaning. Detail, right? So I do detail so how cleaning. how do you feel when people say, oh, you're a maid? What, what do you say to them? I say, yeah. Uh, you have me? no clue. <laughs> I, clean, I clean luxury homes on the beach. Coco, it's freaking awesome. And you know what? You kept saying, ATL. I am yes. from the ATL. We are from Atlanta. Go dogs. Represent. South End's room. ATL, baby. Yes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so what do you think about, do y'all look at like the, pre the pregnancy, what's going on with Donald, um, Donald Trump and all Oh, that I love stuff? Donald Trump. Why? Actually, why do you like why do Well, you like because him? he's real. Because he's real. He says our, our stuff is messed up, and it is messed up, and we need to get back on track. So you think he's going to clean everything up? Well, I don't know how much he can clean up in uh, one term. Or any of them, for that but, matter. But, you know, yeah, yeah, we need a new president. So yes. what about Hillary? Oh, Hillary's... Pfft. We want a woman in this, in this... No, we don't. No, we don't. Why? No. You tell me why. Because men should rule the world. That's it. Women, are, women are not meant to do that because we're too emotional. Okay? Bottom line. So you say... I'm, I'm old fashioned. I'm old. I'm old school, dude. I'm 50. Uh, did I say that online? I mean, uh, you're 41. I'm 25. <laughs> Can you hear me now? That's right. Tell me what kind of music y'all listen to. Uh, everything. Yeah, everything. We, we listen basically. to everything. We're, we, we are very cultured. We like to have a good music. time when we're off work. No. So what, what's a good it? time? To, what's a good time for you? We love going to the beach. Yes, she lives right near the beach. Yeah. We go the, all the time. I live out in have, Titusville, so we have a great time down and go straight it's to the relaxing. Beach. Yeah, I love the beach or the love pool. Love the beach. Yes. But, okay, Fire. so you love the beach. Any beach in the in the world that oh, you would go damn. to? What? Where would it be? Oh, now I went to. I would um, think like Hawaii or something or Maui. Never or been there, so I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know either. <laughs> she's like, she's like, don't I just know what I'm saying. I've been to the pictures. West Coast and and um. The West Coast is good. And we went to Seb um not Sebastian that's over here um, where did we go when me and you went to the concert? Oh, Tampa. Yeah. So we were on that side, but the the uh, Saratoga. What is that beach Sarasota. called? Yeah, uh, <laughs> something key. It's it's a really it's key West. A, no, no, no. It's um. Key Largo. Siesta Key. Siesta, Siesta key? key. It is the nice. number one beach in America. Is that where you want to go? Oh, I went there. It was How was it? Freaking beautiful. Yeah. It was beautiful. The sands go for for three or four football lengths, and then the sand doesn't stick to you. It's very fine and sand. It's white sand. Yes, yeah, it's very beautiful. Yeah. Now, but now Clear we water. go to Play Linda out in Titusville. And it's beautiful out there because yeah, it's all nice. nature. It's it's a it's a it's a government owned wow. property, yeah. so it's very That's beautiful. Very out there, beautiful. Yeah. You know We're what? Um, There's no when commercial. Was out, when y'all was out there chilling out, yeah. you know, by the pool, <laughs> and I was drawing and drawing and all that. Come on, um, now. Come I on. see that you you told me that this is your daughter a lot. Yes, yes, it is. And y'all are very very close. Yes, yes, we are. What keep the bond between y'all two? The, the oh. bond is like not. I think we're so it's much like alike. We're so much alike. alike. We yeah, it's more, similar it's more like a, we're more a like daughter. Friends. Yes, than she's than my, my she is my daughter. So what? To me. What? Well, you know, we were friends. Bond. We were friends before, before even she even started dating friends. my son. Yeah. And then they they got hooked up we in like eleventh grade. We were neighbors. And okay. they've been together ever since. They've been together. At, could I get a grandbaby? <laughs> could I say that? Hey, could hey, I get a grandbaby? One day, one day. Twelve years. You think I get a grandbaby? No, I got grandkids. Hey, we're almost there. Got grandkids. We have meow, meow, meow. because the bond is very, very close. No, we are very tight. We are yeah, very that's tight. Very good. And my son that. is just as tight. He's he yeah, is he's my oldest son. And he is my because I've made mistakes. We've all made mistakes. We've I'm been through hard much. times. <laughs> and he is, and they both are. They've been there for me. I've been there for them. Yeah, that's what we that's do. What We're family. About, right? We're yeah. family. Yeah, she's That's been what family's family about. Yes. Yeah. Well. Family is good. Yeah. Very and my true. oldest son is, he, you know, I used to tell him when he was younger, you were the oldest for a reason. 
Right. And because yeah. he is, he's very good with his brothers, and, and yeah. You know, very good. you know, like um, back in the day that y'all used to tell us to go get a switch. Yeah. Oh God, yeah. I remember those days, and I wouldn't get a big so enough one. So what you think one. is the difference oh, these damn. days? Oh, it's too laid back. Parents don't don't discipline their children. They don't do anything with them. They, they just kind of like Let put the go. blinders on and say, oh, I hope yeah. you make it. No, that's not how it works. Because <laughs> the guy I'm with now is, oh, I'm just on the internet. I love you, Derek. But <laughs> you suck at parenting. You're a good provider, but you don't push things. you got yeah. to stay on your children. you got to hold them by the hand and pull them. Push and he don't want to do that. Right. He's just kind of laid back. He's Very a Gemini, you know. Okay, so you think Bless his heart, he's a Gemini. Generation. He didn't ask to people, be that born in. <laughs> Bless his little heart, he didn't ask to be born in. <laughs> like, in this generation, okay, you feel like the kids, it's always They're too laid back. Oh. Well, they, they, they act games. like everything should be handed to them because they, they exist. They something. Because you know, I exist, you should give me every time. Yeah. No, baby, you got to work for it. I remember we, we used to have to go to the library, you know, for school projects and things. We right. had a computer. We right. didn't yeah. have that growing they up. Got a, they, so have it, they have it right in front of them. All you got to do so is talk they, to them. So if they take all that away, how do you think the kids are going to be? They'd be I flipped think they'd out. Be lost. They'd be lost. Yeah, they'd be lost. They would be lost. It's kind of scary. Yeah, it is scary. It's a, it's a different world for sure. How but, we I, grew but, up. You know, but, I mean, it's good and it's bad. That's our future, though. It is I future. know, it's a scary thing. Yeah, well, that's what that we're new with. robot. But you know the world's Amazon coming to an instant, talk, so. That I mean, it's cool, but it freaks me out. It does freak me out because I'm like then uh, because the you're bringing step? in something that's not yeah, a human, I mean. but they do everything that a human can do. So it's something without it's, a soul. Yeah, and I I, I, must, I believe in God. I believe exactly. in God. Then, now God what is do we good. Do? God is awesome, yeah. and I believe in my God. And we're not doing what He asked us to do. So we're in those stages of life. Because I went to a Christian school. I graduated from a Christian school. Baptist, you know, not Catholic. I don't believe what they believe. I believe what, you know, because I have direct access <laughs> to the Father. Right, right. And you do too. And all you got to do is talk to him. Okay, just tell him. You didn't know what you were in for. Awesome. <laughs> you can and say, okay, and I've taught it. my kids that way, though. And, you know, yeah. I've taught my kids that way. And to not be a liar or a thief or, Honest, you know, because yeah. you got to be real. Your name matters. Yes. Your name matters. Indeed, it does. Mm. It matters. And your character. And your character is mm-hmm. what you do when no one's looking. Yes. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Okay, That's what matters. That people don't get that days. anymore. They don't. They think everything's owed to them. I don't owe you shit, mofo. Yeah. <laughs> For real. I don't owe you a damn thing. That's I've been not. struggling all my life. You know, no, right, no, yeah. no. She no, would be a damn she thing. Be. But you know, even in good times and bad, we always, always laugh. Always Laughter laugh. keeps you young. I mean, yes. I'm 50. You'd never know it. I've had four kids. You'd never know why. At least I don't think so. Anyways. Yeah. I mean, the gray. Yeah. Well, whatever. But anyways. <laughs> yes. I've raised my kids that way. You, if you're a liar or you're a thief, then you what ain't good worth are a you? crap. Yeah. What good are you in your flesh? You're not worth it. Nobody can trust you. Nobody can depend on you. Nobody can. So what good are you? So right. true. And you know, and that's, they don't have any morals or standards anymore. That's what's scary about this society. Yes. Because everybody's touchy-feely. Oh, it's politically correct. Yeah, oh, I'm sorry. Did I just say? Everybody's worried about upsetting Did I just somebody. say the, the, it's the not, not it's southern not, flag? Honestly, it's not like it was back in the day. I mean, you can't really, like back in the day, you can leave your doors open. Yeah. You, you can. can. You, can, you, talk, you can talk to other people. Right. And you can, you know, but right now, it's not It's all like on the phone. Right Everybody's on their phone. It, everybody socializes on a phone. You can't trust there's the no, next person. There's yeah. No your neighbor. You, you can't know. trust them. No, so you don't know what they are because. Yeah. This is mm-hmm. what we've come to. Yeah. All right, ladies. Um, thank you. Well, thank you. So thank welcome. you for being on the show. Well, thank you. Again, Hi, this is Carmen. Christina. Dawn. And you have been talking with Caramel. Caramel. Talking You're a beautiful the, lady. She's the bomb. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye bye. Thank you.